According to B.F. Skinner, if I can find the appropriate punishment to motivate Missy, there's no limit to what she might be able to learn. But what might that punishment be? Whip her with a rubber hose? No, that sounds like a recipe for tendonitis. Administer small electric shocks? Tricky. If I get the voltage wrong, I could spend the rest of my life in an institution for the criminally insane. Or, I inflict harm on the object she loves more than life itself. Celeste, you're about to become part of scientific history. All right, everybody, welcome to the 1990 East Texas Baptist Olympics. <laughs> because we're in the pool of water. Anyway, I want to welcome our little sister, Veronica Duncan, who I will be Duncan. <laughs> Sorry, I can't turn it off. And I also want to welcome George Cooper, who has recently found his way to the Lord. Howdy, praise Jesus. Are you ready to learn some advanced calculus? Nope. Be right back. Take your time. Veronica. Do you trust in Jesus Christ as your personal Lord and Savior? I do. <laughs> it's upon your profession of faith that I baptize you, my sister, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Wait in the water. Wait in the water, children. Wait in the water. Washing me down, washing me down. All right, let's try this again. Would you be ready to learn some advanced calculus if it saves Celeste's pigtails? What are you doing? Put her down. Not until I modify your behavior. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. Me in the water. Sheldon, I'm warning you. Hallelujah! <laughs> we did it! <laughs> oh, I'm so happy. I love you. Is it working? Are you feeling motivated? Very. Care to explain yourself? I was trying to motivate Missy to expand her intellectual horizons. By torturing her Cabbage Patch doll. Well, it's not like I shocked her with electrodes, which was an option. Enough! To be clear, I meant to shock Missy, not the doll. That would be ineffective. Enough! And you! Getting baptized just to kiss a girl? What were you thinking? Sounds like you know what I was thinking. Well, you are both grounded. I'm your number one fan. I like you because you're an alien, but you're funny. Unlike my brother who's an alien, but just a jerk. Anyway, I hope you're enjoying your time here on our planet and have found things to eat other than cats. I recommend chicken nuggets. Sincerely, Missy Cooper, age 10. P.S. My favorite color is pink. What's yours? <laughs> what a cutie pie. Hey, hey, Barbara, we got any more of those pink t-shirts with my face on them? I want to send one to this Missy Cooper kid. Oh, oh, and get me some chicken nuggets, huh? Hello? Anybody out there? Apparently not. 